Hey YouTube and welcome to the 8th episode of Operating System Development Series provided by the iNow channel. This is the part 3 of Interrupts, so let's get started. So, welcome again to the 8th episode of Operating System Development Series and part 3 of Interrupts. So, in this video, it's going to be very quick uh, where we're going to be uh, adding the compilation codes to make um, the files that we've added in our operating system get executed properly. So here we've got the isr.c the idt.c and the util.c. Now, <coughs> all you need to do is inside the build.sh file, you have to add the the util.c, so gcz-m32-c space the include folder slash util.c. This is the utility files that we're going to be compiling. Dash o space uh, the object folder where you want to the, the uh, utility.c file output to be stored. So it's going to be stored inside the object file under the name of utility.o and of course the free standing there. And uh, also the, the here the isr.c so it is inside the include folder is going to be uh, compiled under the name of isr.o under the object folder and the idt.c is going to be compiled under the name of idt.o and finally we are going to be add those uh, object files to the linking process so here it is object slash isr.o and then here idt.o and util.o and finally we're going to be compiling our operating system so that's it you save and uh, let's build again and run in terminal and it is working so division by zero now I'm gonna go to kernel.c and delete that one to prove that it is working so is it, it is working as expected so thank you guys for watching. Uh, you've been in the 8th episode of Operating System Development Series and the third part of Interrupts. 